Hey guys, Paul here and welcome to another episode of Tech Central TV. On this week's episode guys, we are reviewing the new life proof cases for the iPhone 7. So here in front of me I have the life proof fray for iPhone 7 and the life proof nude for iPhone 7. Key difference in between these two, the nude one has a open glass technology and the fray one has um, kind of like a plastic cover over top of your screen. Both of them are waterproof, dust proof, snow proof, drop proof, every proof. Uh, really anything you want uh, one of the most durable and versatile cases I have ever seen guys and yeah now we have it here for the brand new and latest generation iPhone 7 so let's take a look guys first at the fray model we're gonna do a little comparison in between the fray and the nude to see which one's right for you guys so the fray here guys I have in two different colors one is just a standard black color which should match your jet black um, whereas we have the matte black here and the other one is a, a bit more eccentric um, camouflage green color I mean this is for you guys who really love uh, to get deep into you know camouflage and stuff like that so uh, let's try the black one first so in the packaging guys we get the case of course uh, some paperwork inside here here we have a little cloth, we have some life proof stickers, the limited warranty, and I'm not sure what this is. Interesting. If I'm not wrong, this might be something to pry the case open with, not entirely sure. Uh, anyhow, let's see what the case looks like with the phone inside. So this is the iPhone 7, as we already told you guys, in matte black. So we're gonna put the front in first. And then we're gonna take the back half. Oh, make sure we snap in the front first. Take the back half and basically just apply pressure to all of the sides and the corners until the case is firmly uh, in place and firmly secured. Okay guys, so there you have it. Now the iPhone is inside of the case. And basically, yeah guys, it looks pretty similar to last year's version for the 6 6s. Basically everything is the same, buttons feel just as nice. We got the rocker switch here, um, cutouts for the camera at the front. We got a nice foil over top of the touch ID. We have a little flap here for your lightning port. And we have now two speaker cutouts for the two speakers instead of the headphone jack. Um, cutouts on the back look fairly similar. We have the cutout for the Apple logo and cutout for camera and flashlight. Um, so everything seems to be pretty standard, guys. Looks good, feels great. But yeah, I would assume that it's more or less basically last year's model, but um, you know, fitted for the iPhone 7. Um, and yeah, guys, really excellent case here. Again, you guys get full waterproofing. And I might be asking, why do you need this if the iPhone 7 is already waterproof? But if you guys don't know, the iPhone 7 is actually just water resistant, so you can't actually take it um, underwater. Like, I'm not sure of the exact specifications, but I'm, I, I don't think you can take it fully submerge it underwater for long periods of time, but you guys can take these cases down under water for two meters um, for up to an hour. So that's significantly more than the water resisting slash proofing that you guys already have on your iPhone. Okay guys, so next we're gonna be taking a look at the nude cases. Uh, here we have it in nice aquatic blue and just the standard black, which we have the fray in as well. So basically more or less the same unboxing experience as the fray. We get the exact same things inside as we did in the fray. And I did figure out that guys, this blue little thing here is to take the case off, uh, which is actually really handy because before it was quite a pain to take the case off. Um, so here we have, this is the fray edition. So we have the open glass technology here. Uh, with this, you guys are still getting the exact same uh, waterproofing specifications, I believe. Yep, exactly the same. So two meters for one hour. So the same waterproofing as in the fray, but you guys have an open glass um, basically design here. So you can touch the real glass instead of the plastic film that was over top of it. But like the fray guys, we do have the home button covered with foil on top and we do have the um, speaker and front camera with foil on top. So putting the iPhone inside guys, fairly simple, basically the same process as um, in the fray. So yeah, we have a clear back to this one instead of the painted back which we had on um, the fray model. So actually I think it's just a little bit different to install than the fray model. I think we have to put the back of the iPhone in first and then just snap the 
shunt into place, guys. So fairly simple installation, nothing too complicated. Um, and yeah, I think this is basically the same body and shell as the Fray. So we have the exact same features as the Fray. We have the hatch design um, lightning port. We have the cutouts for the speakers. We have the same fuel buttons and rocker switch. Uh, but basically it's just the screen, guys, that you're getting different. And the back um, is clear instead of um, like it is on the Fray where it's painted. To be honest, I think I like the fray back more. This just looks kind of weird. I mean, if you're going for like a super like futuristic and like techno kind of design, maybe the nude back is for you. But in between the two, I think I'd go with the nude because of the open screen design. It feels much more natural on the actual glass than on this plasticky film, which they have on the fray. But I do have to say that the fray is just a little bit thinner than the um, nude, but not by much. It's basically insignificant, um, but it is just a tiny, tiny bit thinner than the nude because the nude has to make sure that um, the sides here for the screen are sealed. So yeah, guys, that does it for this week's episode and this week's review of the Fray versus Nude Life Proof for iPhone 7. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give a thumbs up down below and subscribe. And if you guys are interested in picking up any of these products, links will be down in the description below as always. Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to tune next week for another episode. Peace.